Alrighty then. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Priscilla, and we are back with another bullet journal video, doodle video at least. Now, I'm very new to these, and I've done December, January, and I skipped February. Why did you skip February, Priscilla? Well, just because, um, <clears throat> I forgot. <laughs> yes, I totally forgot my uh, bullet journal for the month of February, which was, I mean, by the time we hit the halfway mark after Valentine's Day in February, I just went, oh, I forgot to do my bullet, bleh, my bullet, bleh, <laughs> I can't speak, my bullet journal video, but by that time, I just went, meh, whatever. But, I mean, it's too bad because I really did have a good February month. Oh well. Oh well. Anyways, onwards with the March bullet journal video. And March is a very interesting month this year. Just because, if you guys haven't noticed, April 1st, which is April Fool's Day, is Easter. So all of the major parts of Easter are right at the end of March, which is Good Friday, Passover, and then we jump right into Easter, which is, it's crazy because I just wasn't really expecting that. And I don't think, I can't recall the first time. I mean, I can't really honestly recall at all on April Fool's Easter. And it's just funny because it's also my boyfriend's birthday and he's got, and it's April Fool's Day and it's Easter and it's like, happy birthday, you're a joke and happy Easter, here's an eggs, have some eggs, I don't know. <laughs> Let's paint some Easter eggs for your birthday, I have no idea. Anyways, it's just odd to me, I've never had this happen before. Anyways, let's go ahead and talk about what I'm doodling for my bullet journal for March. Naturally, I centered it around St. Patrick's Day. I have a little bit of Irish in my blood, so this is just a good holiday. And now it's not because I jump from pub to pub to pub on St. Patrick's Day, and it's supposed to be really fun because it's Saturday this year. It just gives me an excuse to finally wear my Fellowship of the Ring Rivendell little leaf, you know, the, li the leaf Rivendell pin that the whole Fellowship from Lord of the Rings wore. Yeah, it's the good day that I actually get to wear that. <laughs> It's such an odd um, excuse to have to wear that pin, and that's the only reason I look forward to St. Patrick's Day. I don't know. St. Patrick's Day has always been lucky. It's been full of four-leaf clover, so that's always good. <laughs> Anyways, what I did for my typography in this particular month, I looked, I pin a lot in my typography inspiration on my Pinterest board, and I, you can go and look at it. It's on Wonderland Girl. It's the same as my personal Instagram. So if you're looking for inspiration to do your own bullet journal videos, then I do have a ton of inspiration on that board. And you can go and check it out later. Um, but hey, look what I'm doodling here. Spring is on March 20th this year. It is a lot closer than you think. And the weather is acting like it already. I live in North Carolina. I don't know if you're still getting snow. Hopefully it will all be over soon and we can all enjoy this beautiful spring weather. But okay, that is daylight savings times is another big thing that I always miss and I always sleep in. <laughs> we lose an hour of sleep, which is a tragedy for all of us. <laughs> Anyways, um, Another big thing is that this month I just want to focus on getting our Peter Pan set done for my work. I am the, uh, you know, the scenic charge, the scenic artist that paints the sets for our plays at my work. And we're doing Peter Pan and Beauty and the Beast, and I just really want to focus on getting Peter Pan done by the end of this month. So by the by April, all I have to do is focus on Beauty and the Beast. Uh, I, that way. I, when May rolls around, I can just be done and just have a good May. And plus, I think that the the end of April is going to be very busy for me. So if I can get Peter Pan done with the, and in the month of March, life will be so much more wonderful. <laughs> and oh, of course, I included Lucky Charms on this page. It just seemed like they had to go somewhere on this page because we have the rainbow leading to the pot of gold and then... I don't know, we're just getting all Irish and leprechaun up in here, so let's just go ahead and add Lucky Charms, which is my favorite cereal. It used to be my favorite cereal. I can't eat it anymore because I'm gluten intolerant. Ugh. But I wish they would make gluten free. Hey, the marshmallows are gluten free, so I should just go and get a bunch of marshmallows and eat them on St. Patrick's Day. That's how I celebrate. Eat all the marshmallows. <laughs> 
But yes, guys, I hope you enjoyed this fun little doodle uh, bullet journal video. And I really hope you guys have a most wonderful month of March. And I will see you all in April with another bullet journal video. 